Welcome in, everybody. I'm Matt Seneca, and I'm here with the Employee Engagement Video Series. Thanks for tuning in. Today, today we have a special guest, Austin Barrington, Shift Manager at Kellyville Specialty Tube. Austin, thanks for joining us. Uh, great. Glad to be here. Absolutely. And uh, so we're, we'll just jump right into it. You're, you're, you own your own company. I and, do. I, I have a guttering business. Um, I'd like, uh, like anybody, uh, I started out at Webco in 04. Uh, everything's great. I love the company. Uh, everything that's taught me has actually brought me to where I'm at today. Um, so as far as being a first, I'm a, I'm a dad, a husband, a coach, uh, lots of things. Um, but I wanted to give my kids an opportunity to have something better than what I had. Uh, so through their schoolwork, through competitive sports and, and all that stuff takes money. Uh, money does not drive me. Um, but like we go by, you know, protect the first things now. You got to pay your bills. You got to pay. You got to cover your responsibilities. Uh, so, so I, I kind of sat back and, and really focused on my strengths, right? What do I like to do? Uh, I'm, I like to work. I like to be uh, with family and friends and kids. And so one way to do that, uh, I started uh, Barrington Sons Seamless Guttering. Uh, we started out uh, very, very slow one job a week, one every two weeks. Um, and so a little bit about guttering, it's, it's a meal. It has sizing rolls, forming rolls, and uh, I actually use uh, a lot of the same people to work on my, my meal. Uh, so now we are booked out 71 jobs right now, as of today, uh, and doing between 10 and 14 a week, working seven days a week, eight to 14 hours a day um, and I've surrounded myself with good employees uh, they're great they're trustworthy they're, they're doing amazing that's got to be that's got to be important too especially with you working at Webco as well I would imagine being able to sort of you know put it in their hands right. when you're gone you know right. that's, that's got to be very important right um, obviously on, the, on that side of it uh, yeah you, you surround yourself at Webco and at home with people you trust and you want to be around uh, but obviously, uh, my wife is, is a very strong part of that. Also taking care of the finances and, and doing that side of it. And I do the bids and, and the guys do the work. So, yeah. So in that same vein of, of kind of work life balance, have, have you found you, you sort of have a rhythm now that you've been doing it so long? Uh, obviously, uh, I, I have five boys and a girl at home as well as my wife. Uh, so we, we're always bouncing back and forth and, Everything changes every day. Practice changes, rain, whatever comes right. up. Uh, you, you have to be very flexible. You have to uh, you have to make things work, right? Uh, right? So yeah, we we do a lot of things outside of work. Uh, we we hunt and fish and sports, football, baseball, wrestling, and uh, you know I I have a pretty cool video we're going to share here on here also of a noodling trip of my oldest son who was 13 at the time, and you'll see the the, the emotion on his face and the excitement. Oh! <laughs> Son of a gun. He smoked me, man. I'm telling you. Oh! You got a hold of him. I'm going to bring him right to you. He's right there. Just stick your hand in to the right. Oh. Almost. Yeah, I got him. Back slowly. Don't, don't bring him all the way out of the water. You did that yesterday. Work-life balance uh, is only grace uh, that God allows us to have. Uh, so we spend as much time with family as we can and, and try to balance that and please everyone. It's, it's kind of a juggling act. Gotcha. Well, that's, yeah, that's, uh, it's very important. And uh, as far as the noodling goes, so I, I live in the suburbs of Chicago, as people who have watched this video series have found out. Uh, I don't have that here. <laughs> so, so noodling, how do you, first of all, how, how do you do that? And what does it feel like when you get one on your arm? Uh, so like you said, you, you are where you're raised around, right? And I was raised in the, in the country and the, around the lake and the woods. And so that's something that traditions I try to carry on with my kids. Uh, yeah. you, you go to the lake, uh, everybody has their own noodling holes, right? They, they have places they like to be. 
and they also have places that are very common and everybody knows where they're at. Uh, so you just go in, you fill for them. Obviously, it's it's while they're nesting, so their right. eggs are in there. They're very uh, protective of that. Right. Uh, and to me, it's a lot easier to catch one that bites than one that doesn't. So you fill in, you go underwater, you reach in, it grabs you, you grab him, and you pull him out. Oh, man. Well, it's something I definitely want to try. I think I, I, I last time I was in Oklahoma, I had mentioned I want to maybe, when I get down there for pleasure, maybe I'll maybe I'll hit that up or somebody will take me out. Um, no, so for sure. how, how, big, how, how big are these fish usually? Uh, anywhere from five to 70 pounds. It just depends on where you're at on the lake and, and which like one you find. Yeah. <laughs> well, that sounds like a lot of fun. And um, I just want to say thank you again for joining us here today. Yeah, thank you for having me. Uh, thanks everyone for joining in every week. We'll come at you again next week with another uh, entry in our employee engagement video series. Thanks again, Austin.